Hi there, welcome to my YouTube channel, Confidence on Cat. Well, if this is your first time on here, please subscribe and turn on your notification so you are the first to know anything new I upload. Well, as I always say, if I have no experience in something or a topic, I will bring someone that has all the experience that there is to actually educate us on this. So let me introduce you to my lovely darling. You see, I'm using all the beautiful words, you know, because she's such a sweet woman. Femi! Welcome, Femi. Welcome to Confidence on Cat. Thank you very much. For I want my hat. Okay. <laughs> wow. Miss you, girl. I miss you. I haven't too. seen you this year. I know. Oh, wow. Busy, busy, busy. <laughs> she's busy for me, can you imagine? <laughs> Not for you, just, you know. Busy. Okay, yeah. but I'll here take now. you that way. Yeah, you see here. Yeah. And we're going to drink some tea. Yeah. And we're going to get into deep conversation. Absolutely. A conversation I think we need to have. Absolutely. Because some of us are naive. Mm -hmm. I have conversation with you so many times on the phone and we can stay on the phone for like four hours and you're trying to school me and I'm like, I'm not taking it. I know. But let's drink some tea. Okay. Uh, apple tea. So nice. have some apple tea. Well, there are several reasons, really. Mm -hmm. You know, um, sometimes you get referrals that it, they feel that a child has been neglected. Who feels? It may be the school, it may mm -hmm. be a hospital, it may mm -hmm. be a complete stranger on the street that probably saw something they felt was not appropriate for a child mm -hmm. and they'll make a referral to our service. Okay. So then we have a duty, mm -hmm. you know, to visit that family to try and find out what's going on, if, what kind of support they need and stuff like that. So basically, when a social worker, because when I hear social worker, yeah. I am just apprehend. I'm like, okay, social worker is coming in. I need to get my shoulders all like, you. what are you coming to my house to do that? So the first, that. so when you guys come in, yeah. first is to, to, you know, give support. To assess the situation. Okay. We come in to assess, mm -hmm. and then we establish that, okay, the, the support is needed. Mm -hmm. We have conversations mm -hmm. with the parents, with the caregiver, whoever, mm -hmm. have conversations with the children, you know. And sometimes it means that we have conversations with the children without the, pre the, the parents present. Again, Why would you be having a conversation with my child with, <laughs> and I'm not present? You will be in the next room. And I can't hear him. I can't listen can to hear, the but it's advice because sometimes the child may be um, shy. Or, or scared. Scared that they want to get mommy or daddy in trouble. Mm -hmm. But something significant has happened to the child and mm -hmm. we just need to hear from the child mm -hmm. themselves. I, I, I can I can remember an incident that I was curling my hair. Yeah. And I left the curling iron on um, unattended. Yeah. And then my son uh, Odin picked it up. Right. And he had burns in his on his in his palm. Right. And then my husband took him to the hospital. And they asked my husband so many questions. I was like, this was not needed. Yeah. A child just picked up a curling iron. But when my husband came up, he was like, You were negligent. Do you think that do you think that was as being negligent as parents? I think sometimes um, when very little kids mm -hmm. are in their home, mm -hmm. you have to be extra vigilant. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't say you were completely negligent, but mm -hmm. maybe we're not careful enough. Yeah. So I would have those conversations with you. Mm -hmm. If it was a one-off, if they... Uh, oh, definitely it's a one-off. Yeah. It's a one-off. So then, you know, but the hospitals have the duty to report to, that. To question parents. Okay. And if they're not satisfied with the answers that parents have given, mm -hmm. they will make a referral to social services. And that's so, when you step in? Yes. Okay. And mostly we come in to assess the situation first. So you're not coming in like, oh, we're coming to take your child? No. We can never take somebody's child unless it's through the courts. Oh, so you have to take I me to not, court. As a social, social worker, yeah. I have no powers. Or oh, the social services so have I'm no power. To go into a home and remove a child. Unless the unless court says. It's through the court system. Okay. The only people that can remove a child are the police. police. Oh. Yes. I'm learning a lot. I didn't so know that. I think there's a lot of misconceptions. Yeah, that's why, that's why I was like, I need to have you on because yeah. when I'm having conversation with you on the phone and we're yeah. just talking about, oh, well, I'm like, oh, Troy just did something like this and that's yeah. how I'm going to deal with it. And you go like, no, 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 girl, you can yeah. deal with it like that. Yeah. And I'm like, watch me deal with it. But 800 pounds away. 
We're going to Ghana. That's not the solution. I'm going to... That's not the solution. I'm going to deal with that situation in Africa and we're coming back. And how you does know? that correct the child? Oh. This is my point. How does that correct the well, child? Well, that's what my parents... How does that but that's a cycle me. repeating itself. And this is the something we're trying to educate parents on. You know, when we go into a home, it's not to judge parents. You know, but you're taking my child. We're not. Or you you are preparing the grounds to take my child. That's not necessarily true. Because if I came into your home today, mm -hmm. because a referral was made, mm -hmm. I would have a conversation with you. I have a conversation with your children, depending on the age. Like your youngest is quite young. So yeah, I four. Don't have a detailed conversation with them. But your older child, I can have a very... Which is 16. Yeah, I can mm -hmm. have, you know, a proper conversation with them. Mm -hmm. So establish what has happened. Okay. You know, and then I'll be able to... Um, speak to you, but if it's something so significant like his life is at risk, I will then have to take it further. Mm -hmm. You know, if there no, if you haven't given me um, an answer to how you're going to resolve this or how to keep the child safe and things mm -hmm. like that. Mm -hmm. I mean, our job is not to come and you know. It looks like I'm the only one eating here. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> so I think basically we're coming to give you the the information to empower you to be a, a, a better parent, parent that, that you, you can, can be. be. We're not looking for, I mean, not like um, a perfect parent. Mm. We're looking for adequate parents. Okay. You know, so mostly that's what, you know, social work is about. Mm -hmm. They're looking for par adequate parents. Mm -hmm. You know, parents that know we, uh, that the system knows that they can keep their children safe. They can provide the basic needs. Just providing the basic needs, ensuring the child is not at risk of significant harm, mm -hmm. ensuring that the child's um, education is prioritized, mm -hmm. uh, ensuring that the child's health appointments and all mm -hmm. of that is prioritized so that mm -hmm. the, the meets the the expected uh, milestones in life the mm -hmm. development is there are no concerns with that mm -hmm. you know that's basically that's what it's about mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. okay. i'm not saying that you should be like an a star parent okay just do your best okay and where you need support that support is provided and that is what social where, is it social worker, social worker? Social what was it called? The oh, social services. So okay. a children's practitioner, which is a social worker. Mm -hmm. So the, uh, the layman's term is social worker. Okay. But it's a, ch a, children's a children's practitioner. practitioner. Okay. Yeah. But then under uh, social services. Okay. Children's social services. Femi, I understand that you are not supposed to hit your child. Spanking, <laughs> hitting. I feel like hitting is like woo, 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 hitting the child. But uh, what do you got? Don't do that. But that's a vulnerable little child. You're, you're, in your tapping, you don't know how far you're gonna go. You know, depending on what the, you know, what what the, um, what has happened, or what the child has done, and what state of mind you're in. Yeah, but uh, we. I'm finding difficult. Listen, I, know you I am. I am finding I know, difficult. I know, I know. I, we've had I, this conversation yeah, over know, and over, times, and I I find it difficult because maybe uh, it's how I'm programmed from how my parents um, corrected my me being a naughty girl, which believe you me, you were. I was really naughty. I can tell. <laughs> she could tell, like really. I yes, I, I I I hands up. I was quite naughty. Right. But I also feel that from the part of the world that we come from. Right. It's, it's, that's how we, we it's brought acceptable. up. It's acceptable. It's acceptable and that is, is what we right? know. The fact that it's acceptable, does it make it right? Don't you also think that when we move from different cultures, mm -hmm. certain leeway should be given? Because culture is a huge thing when you are bringing up a child. I understand that. Yeah. But it's like saying abuse is acceptable because it's uh, accepted, it's all right in your culture. It's not acceptable. That's it. It's not acceptable. <laughs> and you must find alternative ways to correct your children, to to handle problems See this, in the home. Sorry, this melanin woman here does not get what you are saying, oh my dear. You do get it, but I, I, just, you're I, I, wrestling I, with accepting. <laughs> No, because I am just living through it. It's 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 important that we we understand where a parent is coming from. Yes, I understand that. Do not physically like yo beat a child out. But that. like, so does that mean that even when I raise my voice, that a child is wrong? No, no, no. I'm not. I'm saying, what I'm, what I'm trying to say to you is that as far as social services is concerned, mm -hmm. we are not saying don't 
you know, correct your children when they're wrong. Discipline. But use the right method of correction. And hitting the child is not the right method. And doesn't solve the situation. It has not proven to work. Oh. It has traumatized children. I I'm not traumatized. I'm not. You think I'm not. good? You I'm good. You Oh yes, I remember it, and I remember why I was, and that stopped me from, you know, misbehaving. But it wasn't done once; it was done repeatedly. Oh yes, because you never stopped you the first time. Oh no, I it was a different thing. Second. No, it was a different thing every time. I think if okay, so that, it, it's it's just. It, it, I'm struggling with this. You, you can't struggle with it. You just need to look at it logically. If you 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 were spanked, I bet your parents' parents spanked them. Mm. So that's what they. That's how Actually, they no, they no. My grandfather. I remember this time one time. Um, I think I was about eight mm. or nine, something mm. like that. Yeah. And then I went uh, into my mom's wardrobe. Yeah. And I just smeared myself with all her body, her expensive body mm -hmm. lotion. Yeah. And my mom gave me. Not a beating, but a correction. So I remember, yeah, don't do that. Like, a beating is a correction? No, I mean, we're having a conversation, so I let's, think let's so. talk. A beating is a correction? Yes, I think so. So uh, the other thing I was going to say to you is that, okay, so at this age, mm. I understand you're, you're correcting the child because you're the parent. Mm. So if your mom, mm -hmm was here mm -hmm. and you did something she was she did not approve or she, mm -hmm. she thought you were being naughty and she, in, at this age that i am at in this age now, okay she's still your parent oh yeah, yeah. oh she, don't worry oh oh she will still do it and it's not like she's going to is that acceptable to you you know what i have to be honest and this is confidence on cat for real absolutely yeah absolutely. there are so many things that as an adult mm -hmm. i would have done if i did not have my mom's voice at the back of my That's head. That's the voice, not her hand. Yeah, yeah but then the hand oh, came yeah. with a voice. Like, it's like, okay, in the back of my head, it's like, do not do that. Mm. You will get a slap. And it's still work up to date. I miss her so dearly. Um, and sometimes I wish she was here because there are certain things that I would have done differently. Right. Not that I am encouraging spanking. That's not what I'm saying. But as I was, let me finish the story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I smeared myself with her expensive lotion mm. and when she came back from the farm she was upset i don't know they might have upset her at Where the she farm before from, yeah. she came home and then then at that time my grandfather lived with us right and he was blind okay and my mom was the only one that he accepted food from and knew her voice you know so it was it, so that was my mom was like the caretaker of grandpa i remember that <laughs> That is so funny. <laughs> After my mom finished beating, mm -hmm. correcting me. I'm not going to say beating. Correcting me. She went to the room. Is that a new word for it? Yeah, correction. Okay. <laughs> correction. Right. She went to the room to give my grandfather some His food. food yeah. All we could hear was mom coming out screaming. Really? Screaming out of the room. Later on, we found out that because grandpa heard me crying so <laughs> grandpa timed her oh took his slippers <laughs> and walked really yes wow and i remember this very well because it, it's, it's actually one of the uh, one of the things i remember about my grandpa i don't remember much about my grandpa but that's mm. one of the things i remember m m from my grandpa mm. and for me at that age mom is still be disciplined by grandpa it stuck with me and i'm not saying that well we're in different situations now the world has moved on you know kids can ask us i'm well. in a different environment i'm not in the village somewhere in mm -hmm. Adidome. so things work differently mm -hmm. but i also think we should be given parents a little bit of some control you have parents have control parents have control like i said if say you struggling to give uh, instructions or for your child to take instructions from mm -hmm. you. You can ask for help from social services. And what is social services coming? What are they coming in there to do? To give you support. Okay. I've talked about parenting classes. Mm -hmm. 
which some parents really, really benefit need. from. Okay. And they need. Mm -hmm. so, because some people, this is their first time they're, they're a parent. They have a child, yeah. Yeah. So it's, there's no manual with it. Mm -hmm. It's just like, okay, I've got this. So do you guys understand that there's no manual? We do understand that. That every parent deal with situations differently. Spanking or hitting a child is not. We're not going answer. back to the spanking because, and all. Because you, your basis of what you're, you're thinking that the power, that power of. It's not. It's not a matter of like. It's not a matter of power. It's. Oh, I'm finding this difficult today. Yes. I'm just finding the words difficult because I'm being careful and being extremely sensitive to the situation. And uh, listen, darling. Yes. I want to be able to. Okay. Troy knows. When his name is Troy, yeah. that's not serious. But when it's Troy, yeah. <laughs> something is just going down. That is wrong. So why isn't that? So enough? then, because uh, why isn't that? Kids enough? push it. They push it. So then you find different strategies. Okay. Learn. Ask for help. You will receive the help. Support will be given to you. All right. You don't need to resort to okay. hitting a child or threatening the child because oh. that's not acceptable. <laughs> oh, the it's threats. Okay, so... It's not acceptable. <laughs> okay, so me and you're, Troy. You're traumatizing the child oh. and you're putting fear into oh. the child. Let me go to this. This is not a threat. So me and Troy, we had a conversation. Right. And the conversation was, we're like, I was like, Troy, stop it. Yeah. If you don't stop it now, you know, I'm going to beat you up. And then he goes like, why are you threatening me? Oh, I turn around and I go like, Darling, it's not a threat. It's a promise. Turn down for what? Ghana is 800 pounds a week. <laughs> we'll go and come back. So, with the I mean, same. Does that make sense to you, though? It does. <laughs> it doesn't make logical sense. It makes logical sense to me. I'm sorry. It does. But guess what? What? He stopped. Whatever it was, he stopped it. Right. So you feel that if someone offends Trey outside, it should mm -hmm. threaten them and they'll stop. Oh no, no, no. I'm his mother. I understand that, but he's learning from you from the No, threats. he's not going to he knows he's not going to go How and How does he know? Okay, today I, I feel like, today I feel like my parents my parenting skills is no, being questioned. No, I'm not quite because no. I have uh, and you know what, Sweetheart. Troy, I have to say this, Troy is so happy behind that camera. He's like, yeah, auntie, give it to her. Auntie, give it to her. Yeah, okay, it's no, no, fine. No, I would never question your parenting skills. Yeah. I'm just trying to educate you a little bit. You, we have conversation, you know that. I know. But there is a lot of misconception about the role of social services. When I hear social services, all I hear I is they're coming in, they're going to take my child, blah, 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 blah. So you know what? I have this in my head. It's a and movie. I'm that. The process, even to remove a child from a family, it's from a court, it's a court long. order. It's mm. not good tomorrow unless the child there's significant concerns that the child cannot remove, remain in that um, that family. So then the police come it's in. Quickly. It's quickly. It's done through the police, mm -hmm. and then uh, so she go to court, and then. Also you know when I when 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 I hear people go like oh don't do that social services is going to come for your child, in my head, I have it all pre-planned. The suitcase is packed. Really? Oh yeah, the suitcase is packed. <laughs> you want to take him? There he is. There's a suitcase. You can go. It's not as simple as that. Oh, trust me, you there's know me better. Investigations. Oh, um, I don't mind. Come for him. Oh, can he can go. Find out. Oh, baby, why he can child? go. Oh, darling, he can go. You don't go. want to look after him, like you know. Why would you send? Because why would you want to walk into my home? And to give you support, so like your, yeah, child so is not, your child is not subjected to any harm. I'm not harming him, I'm feeding him, I'm feeding him aggression. I'm not aggressive. We love each other, we kiss every night. <laughs> Try is <and> dying. <laughs> oh my goodness, we need to have a part two to this. <laughs> Try is dying because you know what. I want us to have a part two to this. Right. 
because I would want the viewers okay. to leave their comments. So we'll come back to this Absolutely. so they can bring their experiences Absolutely. and their questions Absolutely. to Bard. Absolutely. Remember that you can send in all your questions. You know how to find us, you know, confidence, uh, confidence on cart on Instagram, confidence on cart on Facebook, confidence on cart YouTube. That's where our home is. And I will really, really love to hear your comments. Read out your comments and your questions to Femi so she can educate us more. I'm sounding like a dead drum right now. Like I'm stuck in my old ways. So I really want to see or hear what is out there. How other parents are dealing with, you know, parents, parenting. It's a difficult thing. It difficult. It's difficult. And I hope that sometimes social services will give us some slack. Like I've said, I mean, I don't, I don't know. I think because there's so much um, stigma. Yes, between, yeah, because yeah, all the, the oh, listen, all you hear is the horror stories yeah. of social services. Yeah. And that is the reason why it is a re, oh, darling, I'm so grateful. I'm, I'm I am so grateful. I'm, I'm so grateful there. because yeah. sometimes this is not the end of this conversation. We'll be back. We'll definitely bring it back. Don't forget to subscribe. Turn on your notification so you be the first to know anything we upload new. I really want to have this conversation further. So I'm waiting for your comments and your comments are going to be the key to this, the next part of this conversation. Mm, as you say, don't spank your child. <laughs> Put them in a what? Naughty corner. Right? What else? Well, I mean, what else are you... Fine. Give us the last tidbits, like do your five key things that you say to a parent. If you're struggling to um, parent your child, yeah. ask for support. Mm -hmm. The support is available. Mm -hmm. if, the, uh, if you have... If you need parenting classes, mm -hmm. if you think that um, there's a family friend or um, another family member mm -hmm. that could take your child away for a break mm -hmm. so you, your child can go stay yeah. here while you try to figure out why things are not working between the two mm -hmm. of you or why the child's mm -hmm. not listening to you. Mm -hmm. If there's somebody that the child listens to more than you, yeah. try to bring that person because we try to unite families. Okay. We not are all separate about, no, them. No, no, no. We try to okay. bring, keep children with their families okay. within their families. Okay. So we encourage parents to do that. Okay. You thank know. you so much. Thank You're you, welcome, darling. darling. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Mm -hmm. See you guys bye bye, bye. next time